Ferdinando Bocconi was a genius of his time. In 1902, he founded Bocconi University to remember his son, but he also was very much into creating something that will change society and the world. He embedded this in the ethos of our university. Bocconi, by virtue of being a university, everyone has a reason for being here. And so this combined with such a level of education that's offered here has churned out very, very motivated students. Bocconi is a place where we try to change the world through producing original knowledge and we change the life of our students. Bocconi University is a vibrant community that is uh, international, dedicated to excellence in uh, research and teaching, and it does it in the heart of Milan, which is a capital of design and fashion. So I think we are really a great university with a window to the world. With the university growing, becoming the most important Italian university in a number of fields, we also became a more innovative university. It's really great to be able to teach such a vibrant community of students uh, that come from across the world. We have about 111 nationalities on campus. So that's a really an enriching environment as a professor to be able to teach from diverse viewpoints, to hear different viewpoints, and we're really dedicated to integrating them into our student life and into our campus life. It's been extremely welcoming, I have to say, that Bocconi, it is in, not just in Italian, you mentioned it is in Italy, yes, it's in Milan, of course, but Milan itself is a global hub of the economy and the industry leaders, so it's a very particular place to be. Everyone is kind of in the same boat. The community couldn't be more welcoming to, to everyone. There's always plenty of things to do. Within the university itself, um, there's so many opportunities, both in and out of the classroom. Opportunities like studying abroad, opportunities such as being involved in campus administration, and plenty of different courses to choose from. So I would say that it really fosters an environment that is not only international, but also it's pushing you to do better. The world is in huge change. In some ways, we're in an inflection point. We're in the fourth technological revolution. We are dealing with climate change. We are dealing with an increase of geopolitics and war and security issues in the world. And we are very really cognizant at Bocconi about that by integrating more social science within existing programs. So I think we do it by providing people data analytical skills and uh, introductions into artificial intelligence. And we want them to understand most of these things, but do it from a big, a kind of data oriented perspective. Teaching and researching at Bocconi as a member of faculty here has several advantages. So Bocconi has been very accommodating and helpful in uh, me setting up a lab, a research infrastructure. As a teacher, it's really stimulating because I get to interact with a lot of very, very ambitious and driven students uh, that come from a variety of backgrounds. And we have a new computing sciences department as of 2022, which is still in its infancy. It's still growing. In terms of research, uh, currently we have the opportunity to work not simply with, uh, with small data, but also with big data. And so this is great for research, because research in social sciences is about uh, interaction with people. Uh, with digital technology, you can, of course, empower students uh, outside the class and within the class. We teach innovation both at a bachelor and a master of science level. Innovation and entrepreneurship are a crucial field. And I like to say that they are crucial not only for Bocconi, but in these days they are crucial for the society. 
It's very difficult to predict where AI is going to go next, not just because it's difficult to predict the future in general, but especially because this field has accelerated so much. But we know that it will accelerate even more. What students can expect that get into this is a very dynamic field where things change on a rapid basis. Getting into this will mean to be very flexible, it will mean to innovate, it will mean to come up with new ideas and be creative. We've been able to integrate a lot of big issues around climate, inequality, data analytics, technological revolutions into our curriculum. And I just see that we're going to do more of that in the future. And we have a deep commitment to uh, developing uh, responsible students so that they really are able to develop deep skills and are going to be able to use them uh, to make the world a better place. I will certainly look back at my time at Bocconi very, very fondly. All of my friends, I know that I've made lifelong friends here, and I know for a fact that they're not only going to be my friends in the future, but my peers. And I will certainly strive to continue to be involved at the university. Bocconi will be increasingly more international and more attractive to young people. It will be increasingly more impactful in research because we want to produce original ideas. It will care about our community. We won't live in a void. We will have an impact on Milan, on Italy, on Europe, and ideally on the world.